So what do we have here today? Look at these buttes. The night guy, back at you my friends. Today I've lined up a collection of my favorite, um, well, actually, putting these blades into a category is really what uh, made me start the collection here. My favorite, uh, I, I call them, I guess, sword machetes. Uh, not a big fan of the tactical zombie slaying craze, but I definitely acknowledge its existence and um there's there's a lot of cool products coming out um anyways these are some of the least expensive that i picked up that i could find uh very lightweight uh sharpness is still debatable i haven't really tested any of these thoroughly enough to say um anyhow we're gonna go ahead and do that let me know if you guys want to see some cutting tests, some torture testing with these. I tried to pick out swords that best uh, represented um, the sort of historical swords or similarities to the historical swords that I like. You know, uh, try to not just basically buy a bunch of machetes. Um, you know, for me, it's it's got to have some similarity to an actual sword. Uh, what, what sets it aside to me is just... Uh, the usage, uh, the intended usage, a lot of these blades obviously will cut. And you can definitely use them um, as uh, self-defense tools. Uh, maybe they're not the greatest choice, but they can be used. However, they don't serve much of a utilitarian purpose. I wouldn't say any of these particular blades are, are really uh, going to be very practical for that. So uh, that's that's the collection I picked. Most of these I got about 15 bucks. Uh, basically your standard flea market fodder. Um, uh, I'm going to say most of these are made by KC Edge. Uh, got a few uh, Snake Eye Tacticals in there. Uh, Tactical Master, Hero Edge. Um, pretty sure they're mostly made, mainly made by KC Edge. Is, is the main manufacturer I want to say. Anyhow... Um, let's get to it. Let me know if you guys want to see any specific, uh, cut tests or torture testing with any specific one. I'm going to try to get the time to do some cutting tests today, but it's looking like a rainy day outside. If you see my backyard there, there goes my, uh, center block setup. I'll put together my setup. Some, uh, bottles have been slain already. Maybe we'll get to it and do it some more, but, uh, these are the guys one last time. Let me get a nice close look again, show you. Uh, we'll go ahead and uh, I'll do some individual reviews on each and every one of these after I've done some more cutting and usage to uh, maybe even pick a favorite. And we're not stopping there. That's just the start. These are just the few uh, very um, low cost blades that I could find. I think they're going to be a lot of fun.